nettle liquefied is my first kind of point of call when it comes to supporting your garden naturally. It's a really amazing feed for spring and summer, so it's perfect for now, when your garden needs the nitrogen for rapid growth and development. So it really does, your garden's gonna start growing really quickly now, and, um, or it has started already in some places, um, really quickly, and it's gonna be using an awful lot of nitrogen. So the nettle liquefied is very good for um, providing really good quality high nitrogen feed, so nutrient. It's really simple to make, it just requires you to pick the nettles, put them in a bucket, container, barrel, bin, box, whatever you've got that holds water, cover in water, and leave to soak for a few weeks or a few months. So the longer you leave them to soak, the more nitrogen gets leached out of the nettles um, and the stronger the feed, which is really good. So it's a concentrated feed, so you do dilute it down to make it go further, but it really does work really well. And it's amazing for tomatoes as well. I use it on my tomatoes mainly, but um, for most of my vegetable patch, I use it as well. But it's really good for nitrogen hungry plants. So as I say, in spring, summer, when they are growing, when all the garden's growing rapidly, or new green shoots, use nitrogen like it's no tomorrow. So they really do need it this time of year. Oh yeah, and comfrey, if you do this with the comfrey, if you've got comfrey patches in your garden, um, I've got a little comfrey patch, my, I wish my comfrey would expand a bit. <laughs> it's a neat little patch, I'd like it to grow a bit more. Um, it'll get there, I'm sure. Um, this process can also be used for comfrey as well, so you cut the leaves, do the same sort of thing, so you can use it for comfrey. And that again is really high nitrogen, so it's perfect, and it's got a good amount of potassium in it as well. So it's really nice, one of the, the top three, the big three. So if you have got comfrey growing in your garden, you can do the same process with comfrey.